Hey, what's up guys? It's Phil here playing Animal Crossing's New Horizons on the Nintendo Switch. So one of the biggest conversations around Animal Crossing is, how can how I can make, I more, make bills? more bills? We've all heard about the tarantula farming, but that's time consuming. We've heard about the time traveling exploit, but now it's patched. In this video, I'll show you how I made millions of bells without hacking the system and with little to no effort. So in a previous video, I showed you how I made well over 150,000 bells in less than one hour with tarantula farming. And then, in a second video, I showed you how I made 100,000 bells in 15 minutes by landing on Emperor Butterfly Island. I've also got another bug farming video queued up right now, so be sure to subscribe and hit the like button so you don't miss it. Also, I've got these money making tip videos linked down in the description and I'll put a little card in the top right hand corner if you want to save those for after this video. So Sunday is now going to be one of the most important days of your Animal Crossing life. That's when the turnip lady swings by and offers you a deal of a lifetime. Typically she will offer about 90 bells per turnip, so I bought as many as my inventory would fill. I actually did this a couple times because I wanted to maximize my profits. But Phil, where am I going to store all of these stupid turnips? Hang tight, I got you covered. Build a little gated area on your island and drop them there. That will keep them organized and kind of out of your way. But if you have a lot of people coming to your island, then you may want to modify this a little bit, you know, to avoid tempting those greedy little fingers. Regardless of the option you choose, do keep in mind that you must sell these turnips before next Sunday or they're going to spoil. So I bought in total about 300,000 bells worth of turnips and I bought them for about 90 bells a piece. You'll want to check the turnip prices every single day. The turnip prices are actually randomly generated every day for every single switch individually. And on top of that, you can actually check the turnip prices twice a day. You can check them in the morning time and afternoon. The prices change at 12 o'clock. So, in addition to everything that I've said thus far, I would also recommend finding a group online that trades turnips. They will typically post their turnip prices daily and allow you to come sell them. Although I'll say, if you do that, be sure to leave them a tip. Odds are, you're going to find somebody out there that's going to have uh, their turnip prices selling for crazy amounts and you're going to make a killer profit. If you want access to more videos like this, then be sure to subscribe and hit the like button.